Welcome back everyone to Kaiser Redux, I'm your host, Mr. Mocha Lover. And right now, we are looking at a little bit of a thicker New England. So the last time I asked whether we should go ahead and continue with the normal war against the Constitutional American Republic, or should we go to war already with the federal government, in which the choice is, right now, for us to continue the war against the car, but before they capitulate, then go to war with the federal government, so this way we can take them out still as well, which would be very nice. Car, oh, the American Union State as well, but eh, I'm more focused on kind of the feds for now, since we don't even touch these guys, and these guys are going to die soon anyway, since the cars actually completely cut them off, so, that's a bit extreme, I'd say, but, you know, that's okay, uh, since they, they have abandoned the line, apparently, that's okay with us, <clears throat> we'll take as much as we can, during the peace conference, a peace deal, we'll probably take Ohio, Indiana, Michigan, and stuff like that, I'm not going to give the feds that much, we don't like the feds, do we? Oh, there goes the United Baltic Duchy. Germany's not doing too well right now. We can still leave the IEDC, and we're currently still doing West Point Engineering. Not bad. I want to maximize whatever we can for right now. So, uh, keep going, guys. You're doing a pretty good job, I hope. Go to Cleveland. Or, no, that's Cincinnati. We already have Cleveland. Yeah. Ah, uh, Recon 2 is happy 1940. Everyone, hope you're having a great, great year. Let's grab some more radar, shall we? Yes, we shall. Um, why is that territory given to the feds? I don't understand that. Of course, technically we are New England, so I guess it makes some sort of sense, but <clears throat> it is what it is. It's looking very weird. Uh, so the car should not last that long, so which will be good, just so we can continue pushing through here. I don't know how the modifier works, because you know when he plays American Faction in the Civil War, like if you hold a piece of territory for long enough, like it becomes your core again. Does that work for New England as well? So it's, I mean, New England is New England, obviously, but like... New Orleans is gone. Oh boy, there goes AUS. Uh, we're gonna need some more of this as well. We're gonna need more planes. We're gonna need more resources. Oh baby, oh baby boy. Not bad ships. We still have carriers. Oh, we have two ships. Look at that. Nice. A carrier and a cruiser. Not bad. And at this point, I don't think the car can really do too much to us. West Point Engineering is very nice, obviously. And what else? Hmm. I do want to finish off the land auction as fast as possible, so... Have you personally me? Artillery offensive, which I think I already read, so... If you want to read about this, please go right ahead. There we go. How many divisions do they have? We've killed off... 36,000 of them. While taking about 4,000 casualties. Overall, not too bad. Not too bad. We're encountering a little bit more difficulty down here, so let's reform this a little bit more. Uh, let's go all the way up to here. And I don't want to be guarding federal territory... Because this is really our territory. We are not the federal government. So, yeah. I would like to take Michigan as well. Let's see. Chaffee. Anything here? Nope. All right. Someone did say in the comments from the last video, like, I said Dag Dagon. It's actually Dagon. So, my bad. My bad. God, that's very really weird. That we, I mean, we're, we're in the Entente. These guys are not. So, if we go to war with these guys, then we'll have to fight the all these guys as well. So, it's okay with us, but still. How are we losing this? Oh, they have eight divisions. I guess that makes sense. Why? Huh. Yeah, they have eight divisions. I guess that makes sense. Right, so I don't know what this place is in real life, but take out that part of Michigan, shall we? We shall. Knock them out. Let those tanks go burr, burr, burr. Nice. And then push ups north. Don't give them any time to relax. No, 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 no. Get some uh, light bombers. Close that spot. Oh, that doesn't help you with agility, which is probably better overall. Max speed. Light bombers. Carriers. Carrier cast. Carrier naval bombers. Let's do that one, actually, just because we want to use carriers eventually, so that'd be kind of nice. Yeah, why are you... Just wait to break over the river there. Wait to break. There you go. There you go. I'm going to finish up Michigan first. Oh, these guys are over there too. That's not bad. Keep holding on for now, guys. You're doing a good job. Yeah, this is... That is... Oh, actually, it was... Well, at least on top maybe did that. I'm not sure if the federal government actually was able to do that, but we'll see. Um, yeah, you know what? Let them keep attacking us. That's fine. You guys, I'm actually going to tell you to not do this anymore. Actually, go ahead and train maybe a little bit more. You won't get attacked, but we'll have to... Tell them to go back home once we go to war with these guys down here, too. So, once Michigan is done, I might just go to war with the feds. Yeah. Yeah, I'll probably have to. Hey, look at that. Yes, Canada. Yes, we'll take whatever you want to give us. 
Help him out, help him out. Might be over river, but that doesn't mean we still can't do a good job. Oh, they have eight divisions here. Wow. Those tanks, we should be able to pierce them, maybe? No, we can't. A lot of tanks. These guys, hopefully we'll get cut off. Yeah, we can definitely kill the feds. Because they want to kill us off. Look at that. They definitely want to kill us off, so. Alright. Burma. Good up here. Hmm. Artillery defense is very nice. Counterattack bias. General Herman believes that if our men are being pushed back, they should fire with overwhelming artillery force to hold the line, even push the enemy back. In fact, Hartman prefers the strategy, noting it allows the enemy to fall into artillery's waiting jaws. Nice. Oh yeah, that's good. That's why I never use militia. They're not just not that great. Uh, let's come back over here. Let's grab some more defense and breakthrough. Yes, please. Good, good, good. You guys are getting attacked. You know what? That's fine. Just wait. And we'll go with this one. 200% mechanized defensives. Thank you very much. It's three army XP. It's pretty nice. Not too bad. Not too bad. These guys are starting to start because they're completely surrounded now, which is nice, nice, nice. Yeah, we got to attack the feds next. It's unfortunate. The feds, they deserve whatever they're going to be given. Even with one division attacking, we can still attack four. Or five, actually. Very nice. Ah, uh, the car. And, oh, it's Peruvians? Okay, yeah, cool. Getting rid of some Peruvians. Very nice, very nice. Oh, feel the agony. Feel it. Embrace it. Enjoy it. Very cool. I want to tell them that tanks just go on ahead, but that's not to be too crazy here. Manpower is precious. Shells are cheap. Men, men are precious. Sounds very weird to say, but, you know, whatever. Uh, you guys go up here. Why not? Keep going. Atlanta, Atlanta, Atlanta. Not bad. Actually, you guys might just be able to take these guys out since we have our allies, Canadians, um, holding the line, so. Nice. Yeah, I don't think the federal, the Canadians really want to fight the federal government, but we don't really care. There you go, go in here. Nice, nice, nice. Head on up. They have no supplies. Or they're running out of supplies, realistically, so. Help them out. And they go up there. This is really good experience for our army. Really, really good experience. Look at all these divisions. So that is about 12. 12 plus 15 is usually 27. 27 plus these three is 30. 37 divisions are trapped up here in Michigan. God. In May. Actually, this is really nice, probably, weather conditions to fight. In Michigan, this part of Michigan, because I've been up here before, in May, really pretty, hopefully nice and cool. Of course, these guys are dying, so it doesn't even matter to them, but whatever. That's, he's a Desert Fox, huh? Nice. It's like Old World Blues. Just like Old World Blues. Just casually trying to kill off 37 enemy divisions, even though a lot of them already died. Some of them have. Counterattack bias, good. Let's grab Armored Spearhead is next. Though he emphasizes the use of artillery and airplanes, Herman is also a strong proponent of armored warfare. He believes that our tanks can punch holes in enemy lines that can be followed up on by planes, artillery, and infantry. In order to overwhelm our enemy, let us train our men and build our equipment to serve this purpose. Nice. Uh, that's a little bit ahead of time. 40, 40, 40. Artillery. 27 days. My goodness, that is so nice. Help him out, guys. Don't worry about moving. Just help him out. King Albert's address. If you'd like to read about that, please go right ahead. Um, this happens every time, so we stand ready. We get more war support. That's nice. Don't really need it too much, but mm, that's okay. Hey, they're gone. Okay. At this point, we're not going to guard the territory anymore. We'll go from here-ish all the way over here. Nice. Because we can go to war whenever we want with them. They're not our allies. They never were. We do have some planes there, too. That's nice. Go and do this and go home. And throw them on the line, too. That'd be good. That'd be very, very good. Entente Air Training Scheme. We've been invited by the Canadian government to join in a large-scale multinational air training program on Canadian soil. It would strengthen our alliance and improve the skill of our pilots, but it may seem as a concession to Canadian dominance of the Entente. 
Who would like to teach us about flying? Uh, I prefer aerox speed. The prairies are the perfect place for our pilots to train. That seems pretty good. On time air training plan. That seems pretty good, yeah. Quite good. Get ready to go. The federal government is an illegitimate beast created by Douglas MacArthur, who has been usurped by Wilhelm D. William D. Leahy, so yeah. I get some more out here. Nice. Gives a few more days though to get some more uh, organization for soldiers. Ooh, we actually have some cast. Look at that. Nice. Yeah, I'll go up to. Come on. Let's do that. I thought we had some planes. Yeah, we do have some planes. Oh, they're still training. What the heck are they doing? There you go. And I completely ignored air for now. Maintenance. Yeah, let's go up to maintenance companies. Let's see. Anti tank. Support equipment. We have 12, which is not great. We're currently using Providence Guards, which. Is this. Hold on. This is seriously what's on our tank. Oh my goodness. This is probably one of the worst templates I've ever seen. Holy cow. Um, if that's the case, get rid of one of these guys then. Yeah, or at least add on. At least. Oh, good lord. This is not nice. Do we have enough light tanks for that? Wait. Wait hold on. It changes that one. Look at that. Now that would increase it. Hmm. I will fumble that off screen real quick. All right, everyone. So what we're going to do is that even though we're still using the Providence Guard, I didn't change this at all. Actually, they have engineers, too. I decided we'll just make Armor Division 2. And I actually threw on a whole bunch of support companies for them. So, uh, yeah. Uh, it'll take a while to make because we don't have that many light tanks now. And, well, we're a little bit in a de deficit. But that's fine. Also, as you can see, the American Union State has already gone and collapsed. Or everyone's fighting the car. Well... At this point, our soldiers are pretty much ready. Let's go ahead and end the... Oh, we can't end the federal government? They have a non-aggression pact? Mm. Yeah, that's not cool. What the heck? No. I'm not, I'm not fighting for them, then. No way, no way, no, 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 no way. I joined wars? Uh, no. Really? We can't go to war? With that's so dumb. That is so stupid. Hmm. In the meantime, it is still 1940. How about some ships and planes? How about some good stuff like that? How about you guys? Can we actually go to war? Oh, yes, we can go to war them. And they are puppets, though. Which means the feds now go to war. Okay, we, there's always usually a way around this, so. Not bad. If we wanted to attack, we would probably lose. we got to be smart about this. Um, Yeah, screw the federal government. Uh, let's see. Uh, you might be able to do very well if you do that, too. Supporting the federal government has been removed. Yeah, it is what it is, you know. And they're attacking our tanks up here. Or just, they're really just infantry divisions with a few tanks on them, so. Uh, are our allies all fighting them too? That'd be kind of nice if they were. Nope. Okay, well. Thanks a lot, Canada. That's definitely sealed your fate, whether we're going to support you after this war or not. So, alright. Very good. Very good for you. I think these guys are trapped up here too. Okay, that's... The PSA, they are, f it took them until 1940 for the PSA to go to war with the Western Command Center. That is, wow. That's all I can say is just wow. Can't beat him up, beat him up. Beat him up, beat him up. We could try to make an encirclement, but nah, I don't feel like it right now. Okay, now you're finally coming to the war? Come on, guys, seriously. Armored spirits are done. Bombing support. Uh, we could probably honestly wait on this stuff. It's not... Incredibly pressing. Get more towed artillery. That's okay. A new England's future. We'll do that in just a little bit as well. And I think what next we'll go up with is pass the Infrastructure Act. Rough winters and a lack of public funding has destroyed our infrastructure. Trains are late. Roads are full of potholes and people are angry. Comprehensive investment in infrastructure will placate the population and give the unemployed a well-paying job, which is a pretty good idea. Oh, please keep attacking us. Very good. Good, good, good. Anti-air is very nice. More ships. Let's get some more carriers. So the best carriers. Alright, anti-air. Very good. Oh, if you want to help out to you, that's fine. Oh, they really want to attack this one division, huh? Wow, you even called it an Afghanistan or something? Oh. Dominion of Alaska. That's good. Help them out. 
you might be able to win, maybe. We'll see. Uh, other than that, is there anywhere else along this line that we could... Oh, they are attacking us. Brazil is. Yeah, the Brazilians don't like us. They have a little bit of supplies in Atlantic City. That's nice. That's nice. That's very good, very good. And all the federal support will die up around here, which is good. Oh, help them out. There you go. Ah, factories. Oh, I don't think we need to see this one. And we will get some more light tanks because we could really use them. And some more planes as well. We need rubber. We need a lot of things, man. Even though we're building some radar here, which will help us out hopefully a little bit. And keep going down. Going down south. And they're still attacking us. Love it. So how strong is the good old USA federal government? Oh, they got a lot of ships. Definitely tell you they got a lot of ships. 155 divisions. Quite a bit of that stuff. That's not bad. Um, I don't maybe mind trying it. We have not a lot of planes, though. Carrier fighter's not good. Ooh, carrier naval bomber's really not good. Hmm. Definitely need a little bit more aluminum. Maybe we could buy one. I don't think we could... Oh! Yeah, PSA. We're not we're not war them, which is weird, but okay. Even if we bought one, would that be enough to maybe make a few of these guys? Maybe. Yeah, might be able to convoy right here. Maybe. I mean, of course, we have the Canadian fleet here helping us out as well, but still, mechanized defensive. They're nice. Let's grab shock and awe because we love shock and awe. Cincinnati will be ours. The entire state of Ohio must be with us. Socialist Republic of Liberia declare war in Deutsch West Africa. Well, good luck, guys. Good luck with that. Can we actually win here? Because I'd like love to be able to break over here. Even if they take Trenton, you know, it's no big deal, really. Actually, what if you just held out and then do that? There we go. Oh! Oh, nice! They shot down one of our planes. Oh, that's not really good, actually, since we don't have that many planes. Um, But whatever. 1940 still. Artillery's good. Planes are looking okay-ish. Maybe get some more of that. More naval stuff would be nice as well. Um, get another thing of aluminum. You know, get two more things of it. That might just be enough for us to actually be able to make some planes. It's not much, but it'll hopefully work. Nice. Good. We take Atlantic City, and then they'll die, and then we can send our tanks somewhere else. And very nice. Don't even move. They're going to starve and die. They have some air bases right there. And we're about to cut them off in Indiana. Or, actually, let's get rid of them out of Ohio first. No, thank you. We got a lot of PP. Look at that. Nice. Uh, let's go to... Ooh, we can go close economy. Let's go to Illumina Exports first, because this way we get a little... There we go. Now we've got more than enough steel. That's very nice. Oh, look at that. We actually sunk a federal carrier with the Canadian Navy. Not bad. And a sub. And a convoy. Hope you guys are learning a lot, Harold. Uh, are you guys split off? Nice. Very nice. So I need both of you guys to just go ahead and integrate and just go home. It's alright. These guys are starving and dying. Actually, since they're almost dead anyways, just go ahead. Put them out of the misery. Very good. No joysies back, baby. Oh, they've been cut off. Oh, they took Chicago. They still have Indianapolis, but that is... That is going to be devastating. We still have to fight the car, too, but I don't really care. The car's not that strong, but the federal government's much more worrisome to deal with. Uh, guys? Oh, I only sent one of you guys here, huh? That sucks. Do have a cup of coffee here, too. Give us a nice and warm. Fast infrastructure. I'll do a lot more of um, this whole Lovecraft thing when we get down uh, further on. So, we will. We will definitely do that. Organization would be nice. I'm going to keep going with, down with more of this stuff so we can get to American capitalism because we need more factory output. Settlement movement. The settlement movement of the 1920s tried to bring the rich and poor of society together in both physical and social proximity. Its main object was the establishment of settlement houses in poor urban areas in which volunteer middle class settlement workers would live hoping to share knowledge and culture with and alleviate the poverty of their low income neighbors. We must bring back this program. Very cool. These guys should be going there pretty darn quickly, so... Very nice. Collapse the federal government, and we'll have a good time. I'll let the car deal with a lot of the problems. We don't have to. Oh, yeah. Come attack us, guys. See what happens. Um, they're stacking up a lot more soldiers here, which is not very good, but, you know, it is what it is. We'll probably have to naval invade them, too, so. 
But this is an opportunity I cannot just pass up. We're going to get a lot more air power, too. Two, two, wow, that's so much. Two political power every single day. That's really, really nice. Yeah, I don't want to lower our import level anymore. So, actually, you know what? Can we grab any rubber? Yes, Brazil. We love Brazil, even though they're literally fighting against us in the Civil War here. Uh, infrastructure is nice. Keep building up. Actually, build up a refinery. That would be nice. Good. Very good job, guys. Very, very, very good job. Uh, I want to take Indianapolis, because I think that's the capital of this tile here, I think. This peep is going to come in handy later on, I think, too. So, Give about five seconds. Five, four, three, two. We're going in. Take Indy. Nice. Immediately then pounce southwards. France, you don't need to do that. Come on, guys. You really don't need to go to Frankfurt right now. Pounce on them, pounce them on, pounce on them. IEDC engineers, move in, move in. Chicago, we might be able to get Chicago actually too. So, oh, guys, help them out too. There you go. It doesn't matter where they're at, just help them out if you need, if you can. Uh, you guys go actually there. You guys go there too. Nice. Oh, that's a car over there. Uh. We can invest 100, that's fine. For now, though, since we have so many, I think we'll use consumer goods ones. I think that'd be really good, so. 15 goes it. Oh, no, that's really nice. That's actually really, really nice. Keep boosting us up. Keep boosting us up. There you go, main as well. I don't mind working on a little bit of infrastructure, but, we, you know, it's all right. Get him out of Indiana. We'll take Chicago, hopefully. Oh, and these guys invaded down here. Ah, that's not great, guys. That's really not great, but good luck. Good. Thanks for trying. Uh, fighting in the mountains in West Virginia is going to suck. Hopefully they can deal with the feds down here more. The car can. That's my hope, at least. <clears throat> uh, so, ooh, actually, look at these kind of a doctor. But we don't have enough. Go civics because we can trade them away. That's the most important thing about them. Actually, trade for one of these as well. Because we need some chromium to start making some capital ships. Oh, maybe not. Okay, rubber it is. Just so that we can get more planes in the air. Because planes are going to be so incredibly important. Alright. Let's take them out. Nice. Maintenance 2s are nice. It is 1940 still. Let's grab some subs. I love subs. Subs are so easy to make. Sub 3s. I've said this so many times. But like seriously. Sub 2s are okay. They, do, they can do a pretty good job. You know. They're not perfect. But I much prefer sub 3s and especially sub 4s. They're so incredibly strong. Or at least they can be, especially with the naval reduction. So good, so good, man. So good. Just go in. Don't worry about it. Settlement movement. I know nothing about that, but we'll read what well, we learned about that earlier. And, uh, munition factories. Let's go with munition factories. To assist our weapons manufacturer, Remington, and to provide a steady supply of ammo for our troops on the front, plans have been drawn up to fund the creation of a new munitions plant in the town of Lowell. Lowell, Massachusetts, which has been hit hard by the Great Depression, leaving about 40% of the population without a job. That is insanely bad. 40%? Oh, my goodness. Holy taco goodness. Mmm, this coffee is pretty good. Nice and hot, the way we like it. But not too hot where you can't drink it. I want Chicago. I want Chicago. I want it to burn. These guys are doing pretty well, though. Let's take a look. Oh, good job, guys. Good job. Oh, another destroyed. Good. Very nice. Uh, you might need to go up to two. That's fine. Yeah, that's actually not not a bad fleet we have. I'm mean, considering we're only New England. That's really not bad at all. All right, so are we up there yet? Hmm. You might as well start trying to go ahead. That's five divisions. They'll probably have four. Maybe max. Maybe. No, that's that's gonna be it. That's gonna be it. Five. That's gonna be really nice. Are they attacking us anywhere else? New Jersey is fully under us, and it is our core territory, which is nice. Um, attacking Earth's River is going to be a big old pain in the butt. I'm going to let the enemies kill each other off by doing that. Uh, torpedo reveal chance. Get some cruiser stuff. That's nice. Five research slots are so good. It feels like we're speeding up just a little bit more since... Well, there's... We don't have to deal with American Union State. How, how much manpower does the car have? I bet they have, they have a lot. So, they have a lot, 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 lot. The federal government sells... They're all scraping the barrel. Wow. The cars on all adult serve. We have way more manpower than these guys. And yet, we haven't raised the conscription level. Maybe, maybe, maybe once. Maybe. 1 to 2,000 manpower. Huh. Gotta, gotta place Texas. Deep Texan Valleys. Or just Texan Valleys. That's that's really cool, actually. Weekly manpower. 
Love it. All right, up next, more cast fighters. You can go one and one. I'm gonna need more. We're gonna need more tanks. We need more of this too. Uh, I don't think we need any more infantry equipment, do we? Yeah, we don't. We'll go more light tanks too next. More light tanks. Uh, actually, we're doing pretty well. Let's get some medium tanks next, maybe then. Do we take? Oh, we took Chicago. Look at that. Chicago's ours. Very good. Oh, the feds. Never stood a chance. Nice. Good stuff, good stuff. Nigerian Free State has capitulated, all right. Oh, they're attacking us, that is awkward, okay. Well, since we have the Canadians here, just take them out. It's fine. Oh, there goes the Western Command Center, good job, PSA. Hopefully we can peacefully reunify with those guys. That should be very cool if we could. Good. Oh, wait, what? They ended their hostilities. Oh, that makes sense, I guess. All right, who can't give me the goods? Oh, boy. PSA? Guys, come on. It's all right, Canada. We love Canada. For now. For now. Definitely for now. Not bad. Help them out. And by help them out, I mean kill them off. Nice. All or nothing. Armor scheme. Grab some of this. Ooh. Oh, this is so good. So good. Uh, make some subs. Subs would be very, very useful. Uh, let's see. Torpedoes. Torpedoes. Radar. And not mine. Like, I never use those. They might be useful, but I don't, I don't know. I'll do that. That'd be really good. Just give me, like, two. Um, there you go. That might all be that we really need for that for now. Uh, subs are good. Good, good, good. Bye. You still make that, but it'll be all right. We have only 11 of this, so there you go. And then there you go. Uh, we need a little bit more naval XP, actually, before I want to make those. Another escort or cruiser. Nice. Very good. Very good. Immediately go in. One division versus... What was it? Eight? Eight plus nine is usually 17, so... Low munitions factories, and then electrification effort. Many very rural communities lack electricity, especially in Vermont and New Hampshire. We need to ensure that all citizens have access to it. We get three more infrastructure, which is not, you know, extremely great, but I'll still gladly take it. The feds are slowly pushing down in North Carolina, which is fine. Oh, they're literally just dying here. Nice. Seriously, 1v17. Nice. If I did this, we're going to do it from here all the way down here. Spread out. Feel good. Do well. Uh, I do want to take out the car. I really want to take out the federal government, though. Like, really, really badly. I wonder if we could break into Baltimore. We might be able to break into Baltimore. I think that'd be a really good goal if we get that. There's only two militia divisions. They're not that great. And, of course, they have a normal Brazilian one, which is okay. It's not bad. It's okay. So much PP, man. Not bad. Not too shabby. Cool. We've lost 34,000. Uh, we've killed off 273,000 feds and um, over a third of a million of a, the car. So, nice. Very nice. Oh, I know creating intelligence agents. What do we have here? Special investigation brands. Please let me know, guys, in the comments below. What should we use for... Oh, we're going to go with the symbol. Uh, for a intelligence agency for Lovecraft. What do you think would be the best possible name for an intelligence agency? Please let me know in the comments below. Cool. Not bad. All right, so up next are tanks, too. But I think I want to read American Capitalism. Capitalism is a life of lifeblood of America. The traders in the rest of the country seek to destroy it, and with all the American way and with it the American way of life. We must preserve it at all costs. Makes sense. Cool. And up next we're gonna grab Rams. Montreal Locomotive Works A15 Ram. That'd be cool to get. Very good. And here we go. Very Albacore. Alright, I don't know how many times I can spam enter without breaking my keyboard, but there we go. Nice, nice, nice. All right, thank you, boys. Can we rescue Baltimore? Very, very good. They probably have a division down there anyways. It looks like we can so far. That'd be very nice. Ah. Can you take half you guys and go right there immediately? Force it. Can you go? Can you stop them from attacking too? That'd be good. Weaken them from doing that. Take DC, take DC. We got DC. DC is ours. 
That's actually a lot easier than I thought it would be. Help him out here. Push him back over the river. I doubt you guys can do too much right there, so that's fine. Well, we're going to wait first. Uh, where's the capital now? Uh, we took D.C. Is it New Orleans? No, Florida? Norfolk? Richmond? No. Uh, where's the capital of uh, Washington? Uh, the feds? That's very odd. Seriously, where is it? Nice. American capitalism, everyone. Love it. Um, so attacking this region is going to suck. I'm going to send you guys back actually up here so we can take these guys out and go through Del Mava, the island or the in peninsula. Seriously, where's the capital? All right. Uh, next tech will be done in four, three days. Ferry Fulmar. That's pretty cool. And I'll probably go for the Ferry Albacore. An improved naval bomber modified to launch from and land on aircraft carriers. Pretty good. Let's get some heavy hulls. Actually, we're going to grab this one. Light guns next. Nice. Very good. Anything else here? No, we need some more naval XP. Oh, another destroyer. Very good. We're doing quite well now. All right. Let's see if we can get to Dover. You should be able to. Go, go, go. Provident, Providence God. Not bad. Western Command Center is falling apart, too. So much PP, man. So much PP. Swedish Commune declared one Siam. What did they ever do to you? Look at that fleet. Wow, Canada's looking thick. Whoa. Unite your total strength to be devoted to the construction for the future, says Hirohito. Very cool. It feels weird being a part of the American Civil War, but not really being a part of the American Civil War. Just because usually you get the option to raise militia in different parts of the country. So, and we don't get that option, which is just very odd to me, but, you know, that's probably just me. Nice, good job, guys. Keep going down, keep going down. There is no stopping this crazy train. You can actually get to North... No, you cannot. Okay, that's good to know. That's actually really good to know. That that's completely cut off, which makes sense, so. Um... I'm going to come through Washington and take out this little part, this peninsula. Is this a Chesapeake Bay? Eastern Seaboard? Makes sense. Nice. Ships? Any upgrades yet? Nope. Go and repair. I think we, we are doing okay at this point, where you guys can repair if you need to. Alright, three, two. Not going to go yet. Got more planes, maybe? All or nothing armor scheme? Cool. Two... One, come on! Oh, oh, that's good. That's actually really good. They can focus more. Oh, well, that, that goes to Dutchies Indies. Help them out! Help them out! Five more naval XP. Maybe get upgrade the carrier just a little bit more. At least three is good. Oh, get three speed three. Yeah, that'd be good. I want anti-air three, but oh, uh, we can wait. It's only one more naval XP, literally. So. But seriously, where the heck is the capital? Is it like Puerto Rico? No. Is it Canada? No, Alaska? No. Dominion of Alaska. Which it sounds disgusting. Nice. Our fleet's doing relatively okay. And another operative. Joshua Johnson. Albert Richardson. Randall Hoodie. Virginia Hall. I want to go with Alba. No, I want to go with Joshua because he's smoking. That's right. We like people who smoke here. Don't quote me on that one. Um, Anti-air. Wait. Artillery. We're going to need a lot more artillery where we're headed, actually. So, actually boost this up as much as possible. There you go. Nice job, guys. Four tank divisions. Oh, wait. This this is the actual real tank division? Yeah. You guys are actually almost 20 combat width. So, let's go make you guys a little thicker for now. Uh, motorized. Motorized. Tanks. Tanks. There you go. Nice. So, that's a real tank division. Ooh, American capitalism is done. Up next, okay, we gotta figure out we gotta break over the river. This is gonna suck big time. We might be able to go from DC into Virginia. Alright, so after that one, New England Air Force. Ooh, doctrine. Oh, construction will do this one. Bureau of Central Planning. Public work programs are a good way of ensuring that unemployment does not breed radicalism. The new Bureau of Central Planning should therefore be created to ensure a central authority in guiding our people away from the streets and into the factories and construction facilities, all for a better tomorrow. Very nice. Is the cars still fighting each other? What's going on? Don't seem like they really want to take us out. That's alright, though. You might be able to win here. 
How strong are these guys? How much artillery do we have? Uh, not, almost a thousand. We can actually throw support artillery on our infantry division. Then. Nice, not bad. All right, so the divisions we are currently using for infantry are inf no subs. Oh, you already have artillery. Oh, that's really nice. Well, that's really nice. Since oh, we, don't, we need we, we need way more army. We actually, holy crap! I want to make it. He has forty combat with, but whatever. Good luck, guys. You're gonna need it. Do we have any more planes? Planes, planes. Yes, please. Yes, please. Nice. More infantry. Very good. Looks like we will be able to break across. Oh, Texas is getting killed by Mexico. Wow. I guess it is technically 1941, so ha Happy New Year, everyone. They're fighting the Japanese and the Third International. Okay, that makes sense then. That's so sad. Almost 100 years ago, they were still fighting Mexicans. Go figure. You guys stay here. I want to get to Mottensburg to help break out of this line here. So go here if you can. Uh, fighting in the mountains with tanks, bad idea, but it's kind of what we have to do right now. Suriname is gone. Very good, very good. Oh, man, looks like some of you guys got hit really hard. There you go. Go up to eight. Oh. Another destroyer. Very nice, very nice. Very good. Another operative, Joshua Banks. Is that Todd Howard? I'm going to go with Todd Howard, Josh Banks. Fall of Madrid. Nice, good stuff. Happened in 1941, like I said earlier. Let's grab some more construction speed first. So we continue improving ourselves there. Uh, carrying naval bombers, very nice. Uh, how are we doing with this stuff? We're doing actually quite well. Actually, very well. Almost too well. Let's get some more rubber just because we can. Radar is very good. Ah, we're doing so well. I think I'm going to build some uh, dockyards too. There you go. And anti styled mortars, that'd be very good too. Nah, don't worry about moving. Dang it. Break over the river, that's the most important thing to do. Fight, breaking over rivers and trying to fight into mountains is ungodly experience that should never be done. That's why I gotta break into the mountains, not over rivers. French national state, they really want Florida back. Sub development, they fit 73 divisions max, less than 200,000 manpower, on scraping the barrel. That is good, good, good. I kind of doubt these guys could att actually attack here and be successful, but we could try it. What if we could try anything around here as well? If they're trying to make some mechanized, but not really going to work well for them, which is fine with us. Up next, you guys can probably go right there too, so we can have a defensive line around the. What river is that? I don't know, I don't remember. That's not the Mississippi. I'm pretty sure it's not, so, hmm. Nice. There you go. We're going to Springfield, Illinois. Bureau of Central Planning is good. Combat the petro, uh, petroleum def deficit. That's not bad. I like that idea, but... Steel, Minutemen... Um, we probably want to go this one. Yeah. All right. But let's go back and do another one. Why not? Let's go back and do something about Lovecraft's new order. To all who doubted Providence, now is your day of reckoning. Despite the utter insanity of the mere idea of Lovecraft running a nation, Providence has managed to pull off what many would previously be unthinkable. New England has been transformed into his image. His work, read by all in the nation, his words ringing through every corner of the nation, and his ideas ingrained in the fabric of New England itself. However, as, as of now, Lovecraft is not, is not but a puppet of the Anglophiles that run our nation. The loyal coalition was born out of fear and hatred of the unknown, and indeed resonated with Lovecraft and New England's wasp majority. However, it is time to do away with them. It is time for Lovecraft's order to be secure without a doubt, and that Providence is finally comfortable with, with being a leader. He can take action in a way that his puppeteers never thought possible. The day of drawn daggers. Does that mean we leave the Entente? Ooh, you know what? Maybe we don't want to do that one yet. You know what? We're going to save that one for after the war then. Just in case. Just in case. You know, you never know. Let's do long-range patrol. In cooperation with the armies of the Entente, it's become apparent that we should focus on a small but powerful striking force capable of dealing a massive blow straight in the middle of enemy territory, instead of slowly pushing on an open front, which we're actually doing right now. So, the other one was probably best to wait. We love American capitalism, though. Build, 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 build. Especially bigger navy. We love the navies. Oh, we actually... Come here. Go hold. Don't don't worry about attacking. Go down there. They look, they look pretty weak. Oh, they're throwing more guys in there. That sucks. No, 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 no. 
Oh, man. We actually might be able to go to Richmond first and then go to Norfolk, perhaps. Yes, yes, a thousand times, yes. Get more of these. Yes, yes, yes. We want some subbies. Subbies for our chubbies. Is he becoming a mountaineer? Yes, he is. 10% of the way there and 24% towards becoming a hill spider. Nice. It is 41. Just going to grab the Valentine. Valentine. Good. Any spare uh, factors will go to here because we want to use those guys to take himself. Uh, you guys want to help out. Special board observers. Very nice. Let's grab some advanced fire bases. Very awesome. Now, do you have any upgrades? No. Do any of you guys have upgrades yet? No. Kind of disappointing, but whatever. Good. Crush those mountaineers. I'm going to cut them off from the coast, hopefully. That's the next step. Follow the Valana. Perhaps the war will be over soon. Very nice. Once the car is gone, then it's it's almost completely over then. The feds won't be able to withstand like all the Entente and us. So, Even though technically we are part of the Entente too, so whatever. Uh, grab some foreign department. Very good. Actually, with both of you guys here, Todd Howard, go and come on down to here. Ooh. Actually, we can't. Well, that sucks. Where can we send you? St. Louis, I guess. And Louisiana, Minnesota. Let's go in. Now, if you guys go right there too, that'll be good. All right, roads looking like we're doing a really good job with that stuff. Pennsylvania's next too. Oh, what happened over here? Nice, three more subs. <gasps> we actually have another carrier. Look at that. Wow, we've got two carriers. The federal collapse. Shocking. The feds actually capitulated before the car did. I'm actually somewhat surprised. It's so easy with with uh, the Anton helping you out in this American Civil War. So much easier than it normally is. Two subs lost. Very good. Race down towards my home state of North Carolina. God, I want to go back someday. But go in when you can. Um, I don't want to do a general attack because that would be actually really, really risky and stupid. So let's not do a general attack. You guys go here. Go in. Take Roanoke. You guys go. With a car left, I mean, they're not going to be able to do too much. Hopefully, at least. Oh, there's a peace conference. The which Asian is gone. Western Command Center was annexed by... Oh, God, that's disgusting. Oh, now they're attacking us like crazy. That's kind of nice, actually. Huh. Nice. Help them out. We won't circle that division kill them off. It's 41, so this, this war has lasted quite a long time, so... attack but nice advanced cruiser holes uh, anything for guns there not no not really more artillery though to homie goodbye to homie help him out there nice another destroyer very good long-range patrols and Ah, but new political machine. Politics is, and indeed, was never a game played by men of good soul, nor was it a game played by men of healthy mind and spirit. Though the unfortunate realities of the time mandate providence, providence to assume a role as a politician, he can still turn the old political ma machines from tool of the darkness into a tool of the light that will work for the all pure New Englanders. Very cool. Former department. Very good. We will begin another general attack soon. How, how much manpower do these guys have left? Oh, they have a lot of manpower. Man, oh man. That's a lot of man dudes. Man dudes, huh? Wow, what is going... Yeah, don't worry about that, guys. You don't go too crazy. Like, we love you crazy -ness, but... Please don't get encircled. Nice. Go down there if you can. And then double back up there. Okay, so at this point, we don't need to be guarding this province probably too much. Or this tile. Southeast, maybe. That'll be good. No, Canada. I'm not coming into your silly wars. Okay, oh, Canada. Crazy, crazy, crazy Canada. 
Does this open us up for more exploits? Oh, actually, we can maybe race down to the coast then. Savannah's already fallen? Yes, Savannah has fallen. Good. All right. Nice. Get right here. Good. Go in there. You hold. They died. Good. Go. Just let you guys do whatever you want, pretty much. Alright, they're still attacking us, but that's okay. We'll attack them right back. There you go. This is one of the few times where I actually like having allies. A lot of the time when you have allies, they just like eat up all your supply and you can't do anything. But this time it's not too bad. Really not too bad. Take Charleston. And they're attacking us quite a bit. We've killed off about half a million of them. We killed off more than any of our allies. I guess it takes an American to kill off other Americans, you know. I mean, they did, definitely did have a manpower advantage, but at this point, they, they just, just killing off all their guys. It's like, wow. Cool. 69 army XP is nice and all, but not quite enough. Not really quite enough. Oh, get in there so we can encircle these guys and kill them off. Come on, come on, come on. Go, go, go. All right, allow people's Democratic Republic or whatever it is. Nice. Encircled. Give some time. Charleston will fall. Yeah, they are attacking us quite ferociously. He thinks he can win St. Louis, huh? Oh, Murray. <clears throat> Excuse me. Pat oh, he went with Patton. That's actually really good for him. Oh, we actually... S oh. Oh, my. Subby wubbies. Chubbies. Seawolf and chance to receive critical hits goes down. Oh, yes. Penetration or reveal chance. I want to get this one. And if you go up here, you have to get this one, not, not that one. So, right. So we go Silent Hunter. Oh, you can get that one. Okay, good. Two Peter Expert would be good as well. So, there you go. Good luck. Have fun. Seriously, have fun. These guys will do great. Uh, light tanks, I think we're getting already. Let's grab some better anti air. That'd be good. Nice. Devastator is lost. That's fine. Whatever. Go and just go on in. That's fine. Goodbye, Division. You beat him up. At what cost? Oh, yeah. That's nice. Oh, yeah. I want you guys to come down here. I want to circle up here. That'd be good. Convoy gone. Two convoys gone. Very good. Japan is being very, very aggressive. Makes sense. New political machine. Uh, since we're here, Eldritch Science. The Eldritch, or Eldritch. Oh, he was killed. Our, member, our mementos and Lovecraft stories is meant to bring good luck, but who's to say that the good luck can't also be transformed or transferred to the real world? More recovery and more organization? Sign us up. Yes, please. At least Todd Howard didn't die. That's the most important thing. It says we can win. I kind of doubt him, though. Uh, oh, they're still attacking us. That's nice. Help him out. Yeah, these guys are going a little bit crazy, I'm not going to lie. They're going a little wee bit, maybe too crazy for me and my liking, but that's okay. Let's see, we've killed off almost two-thirds of a million, which is absolutely insane. Oh, is that another sub? Oh, it's still the same sub. They're repairing, that's good. Alright, I think I still have to manually control these guys. Go in if you can. Help them out. Always can use a little bit of help. Uh, the car is still invading over there, though. That's kind of wild. You could probably break over the river and get a Greenville. That's North Carolina, right? No, that's South Carolina. Oh, that's, that's South Carolina. That's fun. Whatever. Naval stuff. Actually, it's an air doctrine. Why not? I like Cass a lot, so. 
Hey, and comment. Not worth much, but that's okay. Nice. All right, there. Whoa, 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 whoa! Where are their divisions going? Let's go, boys. Let's go. Who cares where their divisions went? Just go, go, go. Well, the American South will be ours soon enough, my friends. And this war should be over by the end of the episode, then. At least you'd hope so. Probably not, but you'd hope so. Civil wars are just brutal, brutal things. Carriers, thank you very much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Nice. Do we seriously have enough? We have so much equipment. I love it. Anti-tank, I don't believe in anti-tank for this campaign, so goodbye. Any other upgrades? No. How about planes, actually? Machine system stuff. Oh, baby, yes. A lot of naval bombers. Alright, not bad. Give them another day. Maybe we can make some more. No? Okay. Construction 5. Get some more output 2. Alright, Carl James, Anna, let's go with Anna this time, she's tough, built for it, tough. Oh, we got seven Cubans over there too, no, we're okay guys. Hundred thirty-seven divisions, they must have sent, no, where did their armies go? I mean, I guess, are they back on the line here or something? There's, there's quite a few divisions, but not nearly as much as there used to be, huh? Huntsville, is that Alabama? That is Alabama. Once we take St. Louis, I might be over them. Maybe. Ah, St. Louis. I've been through St. Louis a few times already. Kind of cool seeing the arc when you go from Illinois to, into there. Nice. Alright, it's time for the next medium tank. Alright, they're not done yet. They should be very close, though. Yeah, very close. Where's next? New Orleans? Oklahoma. Oh, goodness, Oklahoma City. That's kind of wild, man. Ugh, expand the Marine Corps. They're running out of fuel. Eldritch Sign, Stockpile, they've got to be out of everything, though. And which next, we're going to go with... Steel Mills of Marines, Behind Enemy Lines, Import Program, uh, Bombing Support. This feature. I guess we'll go ahead and do Marine Corps. Super Fidelis means always loyal. The Marine Corps will always be a bastion of American liberty and democracy and help spread these freedoms around the world. We need a larger Marine Corps and ensure that they are able to project our, world, our power across the globe. Very nice. So at this point, let's go ahead and stop attacking. You guys are doing great and all, but just hold for now. Don't worry about it. even the victories. Like, we can just hold and wait. Hold and wait, my friends. Hold and wait. Get ourselves on the line. That would be helpful. Missouri. Arkansas. Very good. Give them a few days. Get some more planning done as well. That would be good. And then we'll maybe have one final smash against the car, and they sh might be just eliminated after that. Uh, become a spy master. Thank you. Yep. Thank you. Spy master. And another sub. There you go. 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 Convoy rating. And you guys go up there, too. We'll split you guys up eventually, but not yet. There you go. Nice. They're still attacking us, so they still got some fight in them left. Nope, we're good. Next week should be done in a few days. Well, we're doing incredibly well. Just keep building stuff up, I guess, for now. Infrastructure's gonna be important for later on, maybe. Uh, more civvies, though. Love the civvies. And rubber. We wanna be independent. After the Marine Corps, we'll probably be behind enemy lines, just like John Brown. We will send patriots south to spread the word of the coming liberation. They will inspire rebellions and turn people against the tyrants that rule them. When the time comes, they will help bring down the false government. Very good. And I love that the upgrade time for this has been reduced because of the national spirit that we have right now. Love it. Ooh, you guys actually could probably extend yourselves out just a little bit more up here. Oh, oh, that's a bit extreme. There you go. Milwaukee. Hold, 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 hold. Now you can go do whatever you need to do, but still. Oh, they're still attacking. Like, they're not giving up without a fight. These bunch of crazy Triple K members, man. 
55 factories, lots of fuel. Not bad, all don't serve. They have lots of anti-air. They're uh, no anti-tank, they got no guns, they got some artillery. A lot of motorized, a lot of motorized. A lot of light tanks too. Of course they did go with Pan's branch, so what do you expect, you know? Let them kill themselves on the line, that's fine with us. Nice, that's another one. Nice, good, good, good. Nice. Where are we at? Kill them. They've sent camels to, like, what is this, Tennessee or Kentucky? Very weird. Nice. How's Europe looking, actually? Wow. Okay, the German Empire is about to die. Up, oh, yeah, up, yeah. up. Polish Republic is looking very cool, though. The Dona. Oh, Dona Idribun. That's actually really awesome. So they gave up this part, the Danube Federation. Danubian Federation. They gave up Galicia Lodomeria for the Polish Republic. That's actually really awesome. I like it. I don't like the shape of the Danubian Federation, but it makes sense. And that's actually a really nice Poland. Really nice. Uh, you know, he has no upgrades. But when you, when you see George Bush, you got to go for George Bush, right? And behind enemy lines. Very nice. We actually still might be able to do a general attack. They should be out of equipment. They are still trying to kill us off. Kind of wild, not going to lie. Pretty wild for them to try such a thing. I wonder if we can break... Screw it. Go. Go. Everyone go, 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 go. See if we can break them. They're out of guns. I invest 100 political power because that's fine. And right now... Uh, do we want to build faster or build more? Naval engineers. Eh, that's okay. It's just efficiency gain's not bad. And more output. We actually have enough output. Um, yeah, let's go. Assist with the economy. That's fine. That's still 41. We did, we're not going to do this one for now. Infantry stuff. Uh, equipment. Now, this stuff is all nice. Not really needed, though. Get some casts. There you go. This should be the final push that we really, really need. Actually, you guys have come down to Little Rock, past Little Rock, which I've been through before, which is really. I, I didn't spend that much time there, but it's kind of nice. Um, that'd be good, actually. Help them out here. Cut them off here at Little Rock. You guys stay there, though. Cut, get to Texas. Cut these guys down in the south completely off. And they'll be kind of screwed. Go, go, go. Do we have any upgrades? Yes. And Ernest and Hamen. Move faster. Yes, please. Good. Got the next one, too. Anything over here? No. Oh, do you have another upgrade? You're level 6. Guerrilla fighter, that's good and all, but not really needed right now. We cut them off, my friends. Alright, tanks, and basically a lot of infantry on the tanks. Your goal is Nolans. That's a lot of resistance down there. Holy crap. Go, go, go. Kansas City will be ours. This is still part of Missouri, though. Resource-wise, how are we doing? Oh, we have actually more than enough aluminum. If that's the case, we're gonna do that. Give me more tungsten. There you go. Balance this out slightly more. So now we have how many pieces of artillery? None, because we need way more artillery. Okay. There you go. Now we can make probably some. Six a day. That's not bad. Not great. Not bad though. Um, armor divisions two. Take uh, take one of them off. That's fine. Share the wealth. Medium tanks, we, we have barely enough to cover that, but that's okay. Not you guys. Let's keep going, guys. No stopping here. Literally no stopping. Alright, just Baker. Well, let's go with Wilfred Dunderdale. Denver. And Minnesota. Help uproot their entrenchment. We lost how many? 136,000, which is a ton. We've killed off over a million of them, though, so, so that's really, honestly, not that bad. Oh, are they giving up? Not yet. Soon, soon, soon. Once we take New Orleans, that might be enough for them. Or maybe Biloxi. Probably Biloxi, actually. Which I'm probably saying that wrong, but whatever. After behind enemy lines, you 
urban combat training. In the alleyways of New York City and the avenues of D.C. will the Civil War be fought, and our troops will need to be prepared or excel on these fronts, as this is no ordinary war and no ordinary tactics will suffice if we wish to come out on top. We can get guerrilla warfare training. More attack, defense, and movement speed than urban territory is very nice. Exactly what we could use. Baton Rouge, thank you. More Factorinos. Raj Authority, very good. Actually, I'm going to throw you at the bottom, maybe, just because we want to make sure we still use tungsten and stuff, but if we have any spare things around, spare factors, just throw them on there. Base Strike is good. Grab some of that, since we had a bonus of that stuff. All right, they should, come on, they're almost gone. They, they should almost be dead. Incredibly brutal fighting around here. Nice, grab some of this too. Uh, the Nubian Federation, what are you doing down there? The Loxy, they're looking pretty weak down here. Pretty darn weak. We love it. That should be the last thing we need to take. I could be wrong though. Now all the horses, so I don't want to kill the horses off, but if we have to, take the port and then they'll completely be surrounded. No supplies going in. Oh, the Navy's out down here. Oh boy. The Navy has nowhere to go. They're going to slowly get picked off. Oh, and they're trying to naval invade us. Oh, that's kind of cool. Nice. Um, I guess... Oh, advanced cruisers. Oh, I forgot about this. Uh, radar. Cruiser engines. There you go. 14. We could probably throw one more on. Anti-air 3. Yes, very good. I'm not going to do one yet. Uh, we're going to wait for the next... Get more naval XP, please. Thank you. How is that not enough, man? What the heck? Kill them off still. If that's the case, get more subs. Subs will be good enough for now. Man, we're really not doing well down here, are we? Oh my goodness, they're literally 99% of the way towards capitulation. Just take like another tile, that's all we need. Nancy Wake? Sure, she's Australasian and New Zealander, so. That's really cool. Oh, look at that. Venice is, Venice, okay. Venice, of all places, is gone. And so are these divisions, nice. Send the tanks back up north. The Tulsa. Nice. It's almost 42. Let's just grab some more research. Oh, no, grab the radar first. Radar, radar, radar. And medium tanks. Better medium tanks. Nice stuff. Government staff for schools. And machine system description. It says you guys can win, so I'm going to trust you guys. Go, go, go. Oh, just in time for them to die. After this, we got to do probably the Third International. So there you go, there you go. We might have to go to war with these guys, maybe, probably not. And Petrograd. How many more dead Americans do you want? Murray. Force it. Seriously. 99% of the way there. My goodness. Two and a half million dead. It's just not enough for these guys, is it? Are these guys doing less stand? I kind of doubt it. Yeah, they're not, but my goodness. Well, after urban combat training, we'll probably do this one? Let's try this one. The... Uh a11 Matilda Cooperation. The engineers and scientists of the British Empire have long been experimenting with new ways of, me of mechanized warfare and a joint tank development program by the entire empire has combined its forces to design the so-called A11 Matilda tank. Our knowledge of the tank development is lacking, but they have granted us the opportunity to join them in designing and creating this new vehicle. Awesome. Even though I think we might have already researched that. That's alright. Okay, come on. How, how? How are you still alive? How are you still alive? Sure, they got a lot of divisions, but still. But still, man. But still. But stills. There we go. We got them, everyone. We got them. Thank goodness for the untie. And it makes sense. I said earlier, like, it feels weird not being able to get more militia divisions, but it makes sense to help balance us out a little bit more. So. Well, PSA is next. I want to see if there's anything, if we can peacefully reunify with a PSA. If not, this shouldn't be too difficult to do. But, you know, sending tanks into this area is going to be so bad. Send them down by the Colorado. This is the only area that I know really well because of Old World Blues. And. Underground Railway? That was kind of nice. Kind of cool, actually. Canada. What the heck? Guys. Oh, we got more than enough supplies for that. Nice. Chromium time? Chromium time. 
Kyle Sanders? You're close to Colonel Sanders. Um, okay. There you go. Make sure we got all the information we need about these guys. Washington as well. Send George Bush to San Francisco. Nope. And after this, we'll probably go to war with these guys too, so. Uh, demobilize our economy? No, we're good. War propaganda? Eh, we're good. We got so much PP. -pee. The homie commune's gone. A lot of resistance right here. Oh! Pacific victory. Wait, what do you mean Pacific victory in the Civil War? The first casualty when, of when war comes is truth. If you'd like to read about establishing the underground railway, railway, please go right ahead. Or I'll read it anyways. Uh, well, let's let the video the music go by first. And it doesn't really matter too much. So, if you were happy with the government to the south, just like our grandfathers did in the era of slavery, we will assist those persecuted by the southern traders in, the co in coming north to freedom. Which, uh, up next, we should probably actually probably read um, this one, New England's Future. We are now separate from our old countrymen. As such, we must find our own path in the world. Canada and national France insist that we help them reclaim their territories in Europe. On the other hand, we can turn inward and try to salvage what we can for creating a prosperous New England, or rejoining America. Officials arrived today from the Pacific States of America to begin negotiations about a peaceful reunion between our government and theirs. There is little time to discuss the matter in Boston, however, as almost instantly a public campaign swept across the country demanding we dissolve the government at once. New England, the public fields, is not a real country, and its government does not have sufficient legitimacy to refuse the Pacific request. We have no choice but to agree. A kingdom of Canada agrees. Wonderful news. The Canadian government has agreed that the provisional government's purpose is done. They hold no claim over the New England region and wish no conflict with the PSA, nor are intended to make any demands upon them for New England's return. Canadian ports have begun to leave the area immediately. Wonderful news? Wait, I don't want to... I don't want to change to the PSA. Um... Ooh, you know what? If that's the case, we'll end the episode here. I'm going to fumble around with this a little bit more because we want to continue playing as New England, right? So... If you enjoyed the video, leave a like, subscribe if you're new, check out my Discord link in the description below, and I'll see you tomorrow, as we will hopefully continue playing as New England and becoming the proper United States of America. Thanks for watching, have a great rest of your day.